Several thousands of years ago, countless pyramids were built around the globe. Although we are all familiar with one pyramid, particularly the Great Pyramid of Giza. There are many theories that how this gigantic building was constructed. Some say that the ancient pyramids of Giza could have been built by advanced alien visitors while for some, Egyptians got help from a higher power. But have you ever thought about why there are so many extraordinary claims? We always talk about the size of the pyramids and the huge rocks that were used to build them. But we often forget that these extraordinary claims are just not because of their size, but because of their location with respect to stars and with precision they are made of. So how did they attain such phenomenal precision? Why such a unique building? Let's find out in this video. The Egyptian pyramids at Giza were built approximately 5,000 years ago. Their relative ages are known from patch records of the lengths of the king's reigns. But their actual age is still not clear. These pyramids have been built with approximately 2.3 million blocks of stone and a total weight of around 6.5 million tons. The Great Pyramid is a gigantic structure representing the most massive single construction process in Egypt's history. As for accuracy, the pyramid's base is leveled to within just 2.1 cm. The Great Pyramid of Giza is the most accurately aligned structure on the planet's surface, facing true north. These pyramids are aligned north-south with an accuracy of up to 0.05 degrees. How the Egyptians did this has been unclear. Today, you could align a building north-south by pointing the sides towards the pole star. However, 5,000 years ago, no star sat at the North Pole. So how could the Egyptians possibly have built their pyramid facing the exact magnetic North Pole without even having a compass or the pole star? Apart from this, there are two imaginary diagonal lines extending from the pyramids on either side of the Nile River Delta. This is too good to believe that early Egyptians have known this when building them and so, they were accurate with their positioning. Further, experts have determined that the Great Pyramid of Giza was located at the exact center of the landmass on Earth upon completion. If we look at its coordinates, it's exactly the same as the speed of light. However, humans could not measure the speed of light with this precision until 1950, thousands of years after the pyramids went up. Travelling at the speed of light is theorized as being the only way to time travel. So is it possible it has something to do with time travel? Within the pyramid, a series of mathematical formulas were embedded by the ancient builders. Archaeologists have found nothing that disproved the pyramidologist assumption that the Great Pyramid had been built according to a master plan. Indeed. They describe the pyramid's architecture as being filled with extraordinary mathematical harmonies and concordances, those same strange symmetries that have so haunted the pyramidologist. By the way, do you know that there are theories that pyramids were used as powerhouses? If you are curious to know, then press that subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye!